The upper box spider is ideally suited for four foot by four foot raised beds or one meter by one meter raised beds. It's supplied with a top hack grommet, six meters of capillary matting, circular spirit level, aqua box spider, and an aqua valve. Firstly take the 6mm top hack grommet and push it through the hole on the outside of the aqua valve. Then take the circular spirit level and push it into the recess on top of the aqua box spider. Now in your raised bed, create a shallow volcano. The aqua box spider will sit on top of the volcano. Create a slight gradient all the way around so that the capillary matting from the aqua box spider slopes away. Don't make the gradient too steep, otherwise the water will travel too quickly. You just need a gentle gradient. Then place your aqua box spider in the middle of the volcano and firm it down. Then take your 6mm pipe and push it into the previously inserted top hat grommet. Either wet the end of the pipe or put a bit of washing up liquid on the end of it and that'll help it slide through. Then pull the pipe through inside the apple box spider. Then take your aqua valve. It will need to be connected to the T-section in the tray. Remove the collar. Thread the collar over the 6mm pipe. And attach the pipe to the aqua valve nozzle then re-tighten the collar. Pull the pipe back through and ensure that the half moon on the bottom back of the aqua valve is located over the T-section and firmly pushed down. Now take your capillary matting and measure from the aqua box to approximately several inches away from the edge of the raised bed. The matting doesn't have to go all the way to the edge. You roughly measure, take a pair of scissors and then cut the capillary matting you have to repeat this process 12 times. You thread from the outside bottom to the inside, double over the end, and then tuck it inside the aqua box spider. It doesn't matter which way the matting faces, it can either be black face up or white face up. Ensure the matting slopes away at a gentle gradient away from the aqua box spider towards the edge of the raised bed. In the early stages, every other strip can be tucked onto the ledge and then extra strips can be introduced later in the season. Close the aqua box spider lid and fill the rest of the bed with additional substrate. Ensure that the circular spirit level is showing a level reading. Then take your 16 to 6 mil inline field filter, connect the 6 mil pipe to the inline filter, 
take a length of hose pipe, push it onto the filter and then push that onto the tap. A hose or lock fitting can be used as well if you have that type of tap. Once the aqua box is connected to the tank, it is not necessary to turn the tank on straight away. In the video we're showing the aqua box filling up with water, with only six strips pulling water out of the aqua box spider as it is an early part of the season. Later in the season, additional strips can be brought down as the plants grow bigger and faster and the weather gets hotter. Plants should be planted up and watered through and left to settle in for a period of one to two weeks and then the aqua box spider can be turned on. If it rains, there is no need to have the aqua box spider turned on.